Hello guys, welcome back. This is Khalid Siddiqui and welcome to another VFX tutorial. Click on new composition and let's import footage like this video. And so now I need to create a light, straight light there. Right click, make pre-compose, sorry. First, right click, go to time, freeze frame. And then go to composition setting, and change to zero, zero. Change duration into 10 seconds click ok before clicking ok right there footage enter and now lock your video turn on the audio so I need to create straight light coming from behind of this and going back to behind of this uh, Martin or hail and moving from the camera scene for creating line straight create first light select to point and name emitter very important to create a light streak the light name must be emitter and change the color to white click OK and OK OK guys select the light and move there and press P for the position and move a little bit more far move more far like this and move the X axis there stop watch go to the second till so and now move your light to left side axis a little bit near and go to second floor and move again a little bit down and okay go to second six and move down there more near okay select light go to second eight more near coming out and go to second ten coming like this and moving from camera out of camera and move up so and now make curve go to pen select convert start from here take a look select this point make curve and make curve make curve and make make curve like like this so let's select the move tool little bit arrange
Good. And now time to create a new solid right there. Particles. Enter. Apply particular plugin on particles. Solid. Go to emitter and change emitter type to lights. And then go to emitter size, take a look, play. Over there, your particle lines. Change velocity to 0, 0, 0, 0, and 0. Take a look. That's your light is coming and moving from the camera scene like this. Good. And make more particles. Go to particle expand option and then change particle type to straight light. Select straight light and then make a little bit more huge size for the particle, not too much. A little bit small change to 10 and go to size over life. Select second graph. So select this point, make more smooth. Let's see. Not bad. Play, not bad. Select the particles again and go to opacity overlay, expand, select second graph, and change the color of particle. Make warm color, click OK. Okay, and now change the opacity rate to a little bit of oh. make into three percent and go to effect and presets right glow effect apply on particles make brighter and change the color a little bit more darker and darker not too much darker a little bit darker good click OK apply more light it looks like a fire light like this good let's play that's the light is coming let's go play now moving behind of that boy and coming from behind of the mountain and crossing from front of the camera like this okay guys so if you need to add another effect or plugin to there right click go to new create another new solid and right light go to effects when go to video compiler select optical flares change to track light and press f4 turn on the mode select add and now play again good so select the light go to optical flares option click on option select a different lens flare for that light 
let's see which one is looking good how about this one not bad if we hide some extra details of the lights let's see hide click ok and now looks good good play now there's the light is coming and moving down behind and going back and crossing from the camera view okay let's uh, select light hold control on keyboard select particles select light and right click make a pre-compose and right there light streak enter okay guys go to select add and now I need to make select go to select pen start from here and there and there take a look close and press M change mask to subtract let's play now moving behind of that boy and coming from there so how to control select again press M M M select mask pad select the move tool close close and close and close and close then make little bit fader make little bit fader and move behind of the mountain and coming and cross cross let's make five person for the failure five is enough let's play again cross turn wall from there so there is a little bit more problem double click here select the light turn off let's see play now not bad press space to render again Okay guys, I have an idea. Go to light strike, turn on and play now. The main problem is the masking. Select select the mask, press MM, mask pad, set this point there and move this point here. And move this point up there and move this point here and move this point there zoom in 
make equal into straight line on the scoop black color set there so make little bit straight line and move this one here zoom in move a little bit up and move it up okay let's play now as the light is coming move it behind our dot boy and coming behind of the heels and moving front of the camera this uh, brightness we can uh, say shades shades looking perfect so in final play that's the light is coming and we'll be down and crossing front of the camera wide straight so if you need to make long light line go to live seconds make long light like this let's go back to footage and take a look and there's not bad select your light straight go to effects right at you e double click and you can change the color You can change the color like this. So if you need to change the color like this, or like this, or like this. double click select particle and uh, make opacity to 5 go back to footage in 5 select your footage and go there right curve double click make a little bit darker to look more real estate light select the light and let's control select this point make up play now and now not bad let's play not bad okay guys thank you for watching this was about how to create light streak in adobe after effects animated light you can use it in tv commercials advertisements and thanks for watching have a good time good luck all of you